Hey guys, George Lynch here at the Indiana Deer and Turkey Show down here in Indianapolis, Indiana. Going to talk about a couple calls of mine, uh, what we make and what the difference is, and I'm going to give you a little bit of sound bite with them. One of the calls I'm going to talk about is our little call called the dead end call. This call has our new semi-broken uh, blood gut, we call it. One of the best hunting guts that I've blown. It's an X-Factor gut that uh, took six months to break in. Uh, it's not a deep well broken gut, it's a semi-broken gut, so it's easy to run during hunting. You can get those different notes. It's got good on the transition, it's very smooth, yet it's not so deep broken that it takes a lot of air. So this is gonna be the dead end. Like I said, it's got the speed, it's got the high pitch. We're gonna give you a little sound bite here. <laughs> <laughs> You hear that has a fast, uh, good guttural sound, it's good raspy, but it has a high pitch, and it's just, it has a lot of speed to it. And uh, one of the other new ones we're coming out with is uh, one of our flute style calls. It's a little bit different because it blows like a short reed. It's a little bit shorter than a lot of the uh, flutes out there. We shortened up the insert, we tightened the bore, and then the barrel, what we did with the barrel is we experimented, opened up, put a little bit what we call glodo, which is more of an opening around the guts to give them a little more hollow system. Now we're going to pick this thing up. It's going to operate pretty much the same as a short read, but I'm going to open my throat a little bit more. By opening that throat, allowing more of the vocalization, voice inflection, and my air changing my air quality, this call is going to have a little bit different sound. Like I said, again, this isn't a call that I'm going to use in long range calling, but it's that call that you know, I might get them in the long range with this, but finishing off that last 50 yards to get that shot, this call will be a little bit smoother, but it has more of that hollow goose. <laughs> You hear it has a little bit more finesse to it, a little bit softer, but it has that good rasp and it open like a real goose has, and that cluck, and then the honk, and then the moan. Both great calls, just different situations, both designed different, and uh, yet the end job is finishing that goose and putting the feet in your lap.